This video will demonstrate how to convert raw scores to z-scores. To accomplish this, the steps are to select Analyze, Descriptive Statistics, and then Descriptives. Next, we bring over the variable we want to convert to a z-score. Let's do it for the variable age. In the bottom left, notice the box next to Save Standardized Values as Variables. Check that box and then select OK. The output window shows the descriptive statistics for the original variable age. When we move to the data file, notice there is a new column for the newly created variable called Z age, which is age standardized. Let's look at the descriptive statistics for this new variable. Notice it has a mean of 0 and a standard deviation of 1, which we expect since it is a z-score. Let's try this process again for one more variable. This time we'll convert disease duration, but first let's look at the distribution for disease duration. We can see from the histogram that disease duration is positively skewed. Now we go through the steps of converting it to a z-score. The variable z-duration is the new variable, which is the z-score for disease duration. Let's look at the descriptive statistics for this new variable. In addition to the typical descriptive statistics, we will also request the kurtosis and skewness for the variable. You can see for the variable z-score disease duration, the mean is 0 and the standard deviation is 1. Further, notice skewness is the exact same value as the original variable, 1.383, and the same applies for kurtosis. Both are 1.701. Next, when we look at the histogram for the z-score of disease duration, you can see it has the exact same shape as the original variable. So converting a variable to a z-score does not change the shape of the distribution. It just transforms it to a new scale with a mean of 0 and a standard deviation of 1. This completes the demonstration of converting a raw score to a z-score.